Interior bedroom night. This is a closed set. Please exit the stage. Marker. You're just standing there with no shirt on. Everybody's standing, staring at you. The feedback I would get would be like, is she sexy enough? For some reason, saying no would make me more vulnerable than being naked. The experience of shooting a sex scene is like the least sexy thing in the world. Let's have her on top now. You usually just meet, and there you are touching each other and laying all over each other. The TV industry and the film industry, we are sex ed. How to kiss, how to have sex, so many things we learn from movies, particularly when we're younger. There's a long tradition in American movies of showgirls, literally showing girls. All it is is about the male fantasy. The amount of parts that say nudity required. You're being dissected immediately for your body. Did I have to be topless? Probably not. Body doubling is really hush-hush. The public would be shocked to find out how many hands aren't really the hand of the talent or the butt of the talent. A lot of requests I get from clients is to do beauty work. She's got a little mole here, and erase it. Nobody feels comfortable saying they're uncomfortable. People thought a scene was going to get portrayed one way, and all of a sudden, the director has this other really creative idea. This is such a widespread problem. Today, we're going to be getting to the core of what does it mean to be an intimacy coordinator. There are certain things that are not acceptable now. Sex is a really beautiful way to show things without telling them. It's a vital part of storytelling. Actresses, for the first time, have power. Trans people actually have sex. Women have to fight for ownership of their own body. If everybody is complaining about the same thing, maybe we can do something about it.